is going to be the thing from now on. What did you send me? What the hell is this? Nuclear bomb hits Canada. I have a very sad video to uh, make today. Uh, the Canadian nation has been hit with this new cocky bomb. I'm going to read a letter that I got. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> what did she say? Got hit with a what? Excuse me, ma'am. Can you run that one back? Make today. Uh, the Canadian nation has been hit with this new cocky bomb. I'm going to. A new cocky bomb. He got fucking new cocky. Wait, I have Canadian friends who need to see this. Yeah, they need to know what's. Wait, can you resend the link so other people can see the uh, the new cocky bomb? I read a letter that I got from Brent Spiner, dated December the twenty first, twenty eleven, one ten a.m. My dear wife. I am writing to you from the Canadian International Hospital where I sit in quarantine zipped inside a dreadfully squeaky white hazmat suit. These suits actually actually look like the space suits we used on the set of Star Trek. Why is he writing this just so far the first two sentences that have come out of this like letter apparently are written like um are written like a fucking shitty ass n uh, novella on Wattpad. You know what I mean? Space Just red pill? the way they describe things is I don't I don't think this is real. <laughs> uh, Gary, oh my gosh, Gary the th the sea cow. Thank you so much for being based in Red Pill. Thank you so much for those five dollars. Thank you for the delightful content. Thank you for being a delightful viewer. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. So at the very least, I know I look cute in them. What I am writing you is a first-hand account of the horrible bombing that took place today. All of Canada has been bukkakied. <laughs> no. <laughs> Wait, no. <laughs> it's... <laughs> war. War never changes. Wait, no, <laughs> she meant it? No way, dude. Canada has been bukkakied. All of Canada has been bukkakied. I cannot describe to you the smell. <laughs> the sensations are so vivid in my mind, I have had trouble sleeping. Every time I close my eyes, the scene comes pouring back into my eyes, my ears, my nostrils, my mouth, like a horrific rape scene stuck on repeat. Oh my gosh. Minutes from hour zero, I sat in the hospital room next to Terrance Jenkins. My heart was pounding. My palms were, palms were sweating as I flattened them on the cold window, dilated pupils fixated on the brightening horizon in the distance. I prayed. I saw the new cocky bomb as it came over the sky, <laughs> silent, unglamorous, like an idle daydream whisking across the imagination. Oh my gosh, this is like, this is some shit that I read from my friend's creative writing class that she wants me to read over before she submits it. Dude, th this in no way you honestly think this is real. The new cocky. Can Canada got bukkakied by the new cocky. What is she talking about? Obviously, Canada got bukkakied by the new cocky. What are you talking about? Obviously, that's what she's talking about. Come on. Yeah. My hands were sweaty. My knees were weak. My arms were heavy. Prayers for Canada. Who said the bukkake pop? Imagination and disappearing among the clouds. The room seemed to stand silent, still swelling with the melody of I'm dreaming of a white Christmas, playing over the hospital intercom, uninterrupted by the horror dawning outside with the cold glow of the winter sun. The bomb dropped. I opened my mouth to scream, but nothing came out. The powerful, the powerful blast ejaculated through the street so fast there was no time to react. But, no way. No way she honestly think this is real. No way. How can you get, how can you get bamboozled this hard? How could you get back? This is like, um, this is like, um, this is like, you remember that, uh, that news reporter who was like, oh, a plane crashed and here are the pilot's names. Like what too fuck we too low, uh, from, from China, like uh, from the plane from China. You know what I mean? You you remember that? Some, some Ting Wong. <laughs> she, she, <laughs> it's, but this is even worse. It's a whole thing. Her husband is disappointing. Yeah, I know. Right.
<laughs> ding bang, bang ding out. <laughs> Innocent civilians Prayers. had drowned in the milky depths before they could even scream. Milky Buildings depths. burst. The entire hospital shook under the tremendous quakes of the earth as doctors and nurses flooded into the rooms to gather everyone down into the basement. <laughs> they made sure to round up all of the celebrities first. The next thing I know, I was being dragged out of the room while Terrence Jen Jenkins still lay on the hospital bed. Terrence Leave Jenkins. him, they said. He will never su survive the trip without his left testicle, but I wouldn't <laughs> allow it. Not this man, not my friend. I whirled out of the arms of the nurses and flung myself to his bedside. I pol politely asked permission to touch his body, to which he responded with a reluctant, drugged-out groan then cupped his injured testicles in my own hands and hoisted his body out of the bed. I then began the arduous journey down 27 flights of stairs <laughs> en route to the safety of the basement. Grasping the body of Terrance Jenkins, heaving and sweating, my legs pumped as hard and fast as they could. In no short time, the windows on the stairs exploded, and like an ocean tidal wave, the, the taste of salt violated my mouth and burned the back of my throat. We were being blasted with semen. I tried Whoa. to run faster, but my timing couldn't have been more terrible. Just as I neared each landing, the windows at head level w would burst, shouting blast after blast of semen directly into my face. <laughs> Okay, wait, okay. <laughs> Did she not? I don't understand. I don't understand how she hasn't gotten it by now. She's becoming self aware. Is she? <laughs> she <gasps> She's hesitating in confusion. Yeah, even, even this is pushing her very limits. This is the biggest shit post ever. <laughs> but it's so good. It's, it's so good. <gasps> Has she never experienced? Has this woman never experienced a bukkake? I don't think most people have. This is a shitty fanfic reading. I'm telling you, this is a Wattpad story. <laughs> no, tell me who this lady is. I don't know who she is. I just, I, this is my first time finding out this exists. I had no clue. You did what in my, to my pad? Don't worry about it. The new kake box. <laughs> Okay. What is this video? Can you someone send the video again? Wait, she said, what is this? Fa oh my gosh. Wait, how does it end? Our prayers, but you other countries out there before the and over all the countries in the world, because you can block this new cocky bomb with a shield, but you need to get it up to protect your country. Canada is in ruins right now, and Canada needs our prayers. The whole Canadian nation is in devastation right now. <laughs> no, no way. <laughs> no way. She was like, she still thinks that this shit's in, it's going on. You need the new cocky shield. You don't want your shit to get bukkake. Get the new cocky shield. Canada is in the ruins. Oh no. Wait, okay, wait. Well, I wanna I wanna play this one out. I just wanna see how it I just wanna see how it goes at the end. Canada needs our prayers, but you other countries out there, before the Jesuits send a bomb to your country, you need to get a shield up. Uh, Vlad, contact Vladimir Putin or somebody, but you need to get Vladimir there's Putin. a shield technology you can get up to block this new cocky bomb. We weren't we able to get it up dome. in time in Canada. So I'm gonna make this bit send this video out. This is very this is an emergency. Emergency! The iron coom. Okay, that's um wow. Just absolute wow. Incredible. Breakfast grits? Yeah, it's a good video. I haven't watched it before. You're welcome. Yeah, thanks. Hey, Sharky. Hey, what's going on, Temporal? Uh, probably Cthulhu. 
Are you really Cthulhu? It did say probably, so I'm guessing there may be like a 70-30 chance that you might be. But thanks for the 100 bits. This sounds like a copy pasta. If it isn't, I'd be very sad that this hasn't been a copy pasta. Funniest shit I've ever seen. Please pay for the carpet cleaning. I just puked everywhere. What's wrong? We you got a problem with the new cocky bomb? Come on, come on, come on, have a tougher stomach. Imagine how the people in Canada feel. If you ever wonder why Cat isn't here right now. This meme is very real. This meme is very real. 